So I rode my bicycle over to the bus station, and this is my first experience of what I call dumpster diving. Is they had a big dumpster right outside the bus station, and I pulled myself over, and I hit the jackpot. There was thousands of unused transfers that they just tossed in the trash. So using my bus driver's punch and the blank transfers, I was able to ride the Los Angeles bus system for free at 12. Now, when I told my parents about this, or my mom, she actually thought it was cool. You know, you know now you know it's fraud. You're not supposed to do those things. And even the bus drivers where I'd give the transfers to would know what I was doing. And I was so naive that when I was waiting for the bus and other people were waiting there, I'd punch them free transfers so they could ride the bus system for free too. So my first hack was actually kind of beating the bus system, but unknowingly committing a, a fraud. But at the time, you were given a lot of attitudes. So let me go back to the high school time. When I was in high school, I met this kid that can do magic with the telephone system. He was what you call the phone freaker. I'm sure all of you have heard of Captain Crunch, John Draper, Steve Jobs, and Steve Wozniak started off with phone freaking in 1975. Well, this kid, like, was amazing. He, he, could, he had a secret phone number at the phone company. He can call a number, put in a code, and then call anywhere for free. And I thought that was amazing because I thought it was a fluke in the system. Later he showed me with a blue box how you could pick up a phone, a pay phone, route the call all the way around the world, and call the pay phone next to you and say hello and hear the echo, hello, going you know all the way through Australia and back. And then he had this thing called the CNA Bureau which was a secret number at the phone company that he could call. And if he had anyone's telephone number, just by knowing the secret number, you can get the name and address, which was kind of interesting. The other thing he demonstrated to me is I gave him my family's unlisted telephone number, and he was able to get it in like